Prisca recovered. Bears back on offense.
so uh, just got in there with the players, you know, and uh, obviously the, the group is disappointed in the in the finish there. Just keep going. I mean, that's that's all you can do. Just keep going. Keep fighting. Keep keep grinding. Like that's it. So you know, obviously we needed to start better. Um, you know, uh, we uh, on defense. You know, we gave them 21 points in the first three drives. Offense scored on every drive in the second half except for the last one. Operation was really good by Justin. Justin had one of his best days of his career. 15 or 21 for 208, had a long of 39, had a drop. One of the drops was a big was a big one, had a passer rating of 118. Yeah, it's tough, but, um, you know, I know Mir. I know he's, uh, you know, uh, feeling down right now. So our job is to pick him up. He's, he's just got to learn from that mistake and, you know, keep going. Just a back being special, not giving up on a play, being able to get to the backside, and then he shows his speed. From the 23-yard line on first down, Fields, play fake, throws, caught. Speaking of fake toss here, Fields on the run, throws, caught. Again, gets pushed right back into him as he releases the ball. Not only does he keep his vision, he takes that hit. Location of the football there to Pettis. Consistently in game after game, uh, run the ball, run the ball, run the ball. To the end zone, and it is juggled. Did he catch it? Goes up. Ooh, boy. When does he have control of it? Yeah, the ball no, goes right up in yet. the air. If he would have had it, bobble.
last spring. Uh, what did you see from him at Ohio State? Again, a very athletic uh, kid. He's uh, gets out of a lot of trouble uh, with his athleticism, his speed, his size, balance. Uh, he runs well. He can see the field. <laughs> they lead a league in yards per pass attempt. So, uh, and, and he sees down the field as well as you know at other areas in the intermediate and and checkdowns. And he's accurate. Uh, he can throw on the run. He can throw in the pocket. You know, screens and things like that, which they're very good at, especially with you know with the two outstanding backs that they have. The, of course, the Bears fans are awesome. Uh, just the support they give us to our team, and uh, you know they show up to games that are feeling like negative 15 uh, outside and still showing up cheering us on. So uh, you know, shout out to the Bears fans. Right there with Justin. So I was able to come here and you know just talk to some kids. It was a Q and A, basically whatever they wanted to ask me, and you know me shedding advice on you know different stuff like adversity. You know what happens when you know you may hit adversity and stuff like that. The Bears about to take the NFC North. Y'all ready? Got to. Yes, sir. I think there's a lot of ups and downs, you know, but I think, you know, one thing uh, everybody can say about our team is just, you know, the fight in us, uh, our culture, what we uh, kind of built this year and our foundation. So, uh, you know, I think uh, we're going to keep improving as a team, keep improving as an offense, as a defense, special teams, you know, just uh, all overall.